Hello guys, in this video, we will create new records or items in Azure Cosmos DB from Visual Studio C Sharp. So we are in Visual Studio and we are creating new project. So let's select console app. Next, let's give name to our project. So we'll say Azure Cosmos DB demo next and create. And our project is ready. Now let's first install the required NuGet package to connect to Azure Cosmos DB. So right click, manage NuGet packages, browse and here I will say Cosmos and let's install this first package and accept. And let's go back to our program.cs file again. Now to connect to our Azure Cosmos DB, we will need connection string. So we'll say where connection string is equal to. And let's get this from the portal. Let's open this Cosmos DB account. And let's scroll down. And here we can see keys. Under settings, we can see these keys. Let's view this primary connection string and let's copy it and let's paste it over here. Now let's create Cosmos client. So I'll say where Cosmos client is equal to new Cosmos client and to this let's provide this connection string. Now let's create Cosmos container and using Cosmos container, we can create new records. We can read records from Cosmos DB. So let's say where Cosmos container is equal to Cosmos client dot get container. And if you see, we need to provide database name and container ID. So again, let's go to the portal and let's go to this data explorer. And you can see our database name is test database. And if I expand our container name is C users and in container, we can see we have atoms that is records. So again, let's go to the visual studio. So here I will say test database that is database name. And here I will say C users that is our cosmos container name. Now we want to add user record and for that I have already copied the code for class user. Let's use it. So it's a class user you can see and it has ID name and city properties. So let's copy it and let's paste it over here. Now let's create an instance of this class user and we'll save this record in Cosmos database. So let's say where user is equal to new user here I will say id is equal to I will say grid dot new grid dot to string hmm. and name I will say David K and city I will select Berlin and now let's try to save this record. So I'll say let's save record in Cosmos DB. So I'll say await and to save it, we'll use Cosmos container. So I'll say Cosmos container dot create item async and to this, let's specify this class name that is it's of type user. And here I will provide this instance that is this user. And one more thing, we need to provide the partition key as well. And if we check it in Azure portal, and if I go to settings, and here we can see the partition key is CT. Okay, so for that, I will say new. 
partition key and to this let's say user dot city and guys what is partition key how to choose correct partition key if we do not choose correct partition key then it results in hot partition so all these concepts we have discussed in our earlier videos and now finally i will simply write this line that is console dot write line and i will add a debugger over here and one more thing guys before we run this program we need to make one more change so here i will say it json property and its small id and again this json property and this is small id see guys cosmos database it is case sensitive and here you can see this id the i and this city c it starts with capital letter but if you go to the portal and if i click on these items you can see this city again it start it starts with small letter and again id that is document id it also starts with small letter and hence we need to add this json property in our class or model user and now let's run our program and you can see the debugger has been hit that means record must have been added so let's cross check in the portal so again we are in atoms and let's click on this edit filter and apply filter again that means we are rerunning this query and now you can see we have four records and if i click on this fourth record you can see the new record that is david k and city is equal to berlin 